you know what i am team natural i don't need no eyelashes or eyeshadow or <laughs> I'm lying. I just can't do it. I can't. It's as simple as that. If I could, I would. Every single day, I'm gonna make something great. That's my way. Every single day. royal glow i am royal glow but um yeah so i've decided to finally be all up on your screen oh speaking of all up on your screen yeah this is this is the face you're gonna get i'm sorry if you're expecting like i don't know face beat contour cut crease i don't know but yeah i think just to start um I want to just introduce myself, introduce the channel, what I hope to do with it, and um, yeah, I hope we can just, you know, make it happen. So I think to begin with, let's start with my name. My name is actually Natsai, Natsai. A lot of people find that hard to say, but the way I always describe it is like, nuts you know like peanuts cashew nuts nuts and i put it together nuts i not that hard <laughs> but on this channel like my brand name yes we are living we are within we have brand names now royal glow and actually a name that people have been calling me for a while now is her majesty so we're still going with that you know royalty so royal glow and on this channel what i hope to do with it is basically talk about just things that i like to talk about yeah makes sense so that's from a little bit of tech i'm not an expert or anything but you know it's the internet i can i can talk about tech because i enjoy it yeah um <laughs> don't start any iphone samsung android beef with me but that's okay we'll get to that um yeah so tech and also hair yes i am indeed a naturalista which is why I tried to swerve with that whole makeup thing. No, no. But yeah, natural hair, my hair, my struggles with my hair. Mostly it's just struggles with my hair. That's what I'll be talking about. And also I want to talk about travel. I like to travel. In fact, sunshine just makes me want to just go somewhere, anywhere. I don't know where, just, just go. So sunshine makes me very happy and that's when I tend to do the most of my exploring and whatnot and actually when i travel i tend to go always to to warm sunny places on this channel <laughs> we're going to talk about a little bit of tech lifestyle and travel okay and basically actually my tagline for this channel is basically going to be glow grow and get it so for the purposes of this actually no the bible says it best let me find it uh it should be oh excuse me i'm just looking at my ipad yeah so philippians 4 verse 8 it says whatever is true whatever is noble whatever is right whatever is lovely whatever is admirable if anything is praiseworthy think about such things and i think that's just that that just covers everything so for this channel royal glow whenever i talk about the glow i mean all of this whatever is praiseworthy whatever is right true pure so that's the glow and best believe we gonna get it okay so let's glow grow and get it <laughs> so i wanted to do a little like get to know me video um and i thought maybe i'd ask like i'd get the questions and then answer them but i don't know maybe that it just seemed a little bit monotonous like everybody 
that's the whole question thing so instead i decided to do my own thing in the form of a this or that yeah so i think that way you'll feel a little bit like closer to me like if somebody asks you why would anyone be asking you about me don't mind that just 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 roll with it okay <laughs> What I'm saying is, you'll know me a little bit better than if I just answered random questions. Instead, I'm going to do a this or that, so you actually know my preference, what I lean towards, what I gravitate towards, yes? I think that will be a little bit more enlightening into, I don't know, my character and likes, dislikes, peeves, all of that. So I found 30. I'm not sure if that's too many, too few. Let's find out. Okay, so I'll start with the first one and I'm gonna be looking on my iPad. So just excuse me for like looking down occasionally because I'm just going to be reading the thing. Okay, so number one here is good morning texts or good night texts. I must choose what? And we're the good afternoon text. It is up to me. Good morning. Good afternoon. Snack time. <laughs> good night text. No, honestly, I'm okay. No, 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 no. Let me back that up. Depends from who. Yes, it depends from who. There are certain people. <laughs> well, on all day, just all day good morning good afternoon snack cereal i saw a lizard i all day texts yeah and then from others it's like we're looking for you <sighs> why are you online how did you find me who told you i am online you know so <laughs> i think i've answered the question have i back massage or foot massage you know what i'm going to sound really biased with all of these things because i prefer a full body massage <laughs> ah, okay i think this is beginning to show that i may be staunchly on team like things i just like things so mm, okay back massage or foot massage if i have to choose between the two then definitely back massage someone told me it's because of my height oh by the way i'm very tall well okay i'm above average height for a girl which means i am average height for a guy okay i don't know i don't know what kind of math i just tried to do there but anyway so someone said that because you know because of height I don't know the spine I, I don't know but basically I just constantly have back pain if I stand for too long if I walk for too long if I sit for too long if I lay down for too long and actually funny thing like I gotta sleep like diagonal yeah which is that okay like diagonal <laughs> I try to sleep straight like just like coffin style <laughs> you know like my my toes will be like doing that eh eh like just hanging over the edge so yeah diagonal so that my whole body can just you, you can even see this if i had wings this would be like my wingspan <laughs> so that gives you like a rough idea of my height um i'm actually like one point seven two should be 1.72 meters or 172 centimeters or five foot seven i'm lying i do not know that system i'm metric system thank you so whoever can convert for me maybe in the comment section just write for somebody doesn't understand the metric system because anyway, i don't know now you know a little bit more about me so definitely i'd rather have a back massage because yes of the above <laughs> previously stated reasons selfies or group photos <sighs> so again because of this whole height thing i'm the tallest 
amongst all my friends. So I'm always, I'm the forever selfie stick. So like, just, I'm always the one with like my face, like right here in the selfie, like, like my face takes up half of the selfie always in group photos, if it's a selfie, like, I don't know if they've made up a cool term for group selfies. A groofly? Gra okay. Group selfie? <laughs> let's let's stick so, to that. Yeah. If it's group photos or selfies, hmm, yeah, solo selfie. That's that's what I'd go with. Because also these group photos, I remember like <laughs> school photos, high school. Always always in the back i never ever got to sit down and i know that's such a small thing but i remember it and even though high school was like a while ago now i just still i wish i got the chance to sit down you know like rosa parks okay that's So it looks very weird when all my friends are like here yeah, and I'm a head taller so group photos just don't work out I look extremely tall next to my friends because they're just short I'm not that tall I'm just above average but next to my friends I remember I was asked one time <laughs> but actually I don't know if you're watching but it's okay somebody asked me if I was my friend's mom mom i don't know if that was just about the height or i actually look old i don't think i look old so i'm gonna say it was about the height mother being a full-grown university woman a mother to her how where hmm? texting or facetiming okay this is very iPhone specific I'm just going to change this to texting or video calling okay <laughs> so the thing with me is as I was mentioning earlier good morning text good afternoon I saw a squirrel text yeah I'm a very texty person so with phone calls my default is to watch the phone ring <laughs> i'm not proud of it but i'm also not not proud of it because uh, what why are you calling like could it not be a text <laughs> especially these random like people you don't know okay like for me okay i i don't mind and in fact i quite enjoy calls from you know people i actually talk to regularly you know but a random person from why why are you calling i'll watch the phone ring and if i'm feeling like i don't care at all like i will text immediately after the phone has finished ringing like <laughs> what's up <laughs> but if i'm feeling a little bit like respectful like okay let's let's make this believable let's sell it um, text back like an hour later be like oh sorry i missed your call um so uh it's 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 just been a busy day <laughs> god forgive me but so now i'm telling you this now so that don't don't make me a liar don't make me a, don't call me if we're not cool like that just just don't call me just text or if you want to call ask just ask and i'll let you know if i'm in the mood or not especially video calls do not video call me without giving me a warning do not facetime me do not whatever do not no give a warning be like yo so i want to call in an hour <laughs> in 30 minutes 15 10 even five it's fine because you just don't know like maybe i i don't know where i left my wig because as soon as i walk in as soon as I get back home, it's like wig off. <laughs> Why am I exposing myself? Okay, yes, but the point is just give a warning. Yes, yes, 
that's if I know you and be cool like that. Otherwise, just stick to the texts. Game of Thrones or Breaking Bad? Wow. I actually really enjoyed both of these. For the longest time, I fought against um, Game of Thrones. I was like, no, I'm not watching that. Because I'd only seen like little snippets and it just all looked very gory and scary. Like the very first episode, the pilot episode. It's like a lot of beheading. I was like, yo, why? Why, why would I subject myself to that? But, but, once I just watched that first episode with a little bit of this, the scary scenes, then I was hooked on the storyline. I was like, what's gonna happen next? Who's gonna get the Iron Throne? I'm like, ooh, Ned Stark. And then, ah, they killed him. He didn't make it through season one. I was like, okay. Clearly, Game of Thrones is just throwing all, like, stereotypes and, like, just all of that, it went out the window. Just because you're popular, you can't die. No, no. Even if you're the most popular, the best, the, the hero, the whatever, you can die. Even Jon Snow died. So I was really like, wow, these guys are pushing the limits with this show. So I really like that. Ending disappointed me. So very disappointing, but well, you know. I guess with all that hype, it, it was really difficult. Either way, they were going to disappoint somebody. No matter the kind of ending they'd gone with, somebody was going to be disappointed. So in this case, the somebody was me. And I don't know, were you disappointed? Just, you can also put that in the comments. I don't know, because I don't know what exactly I wanted to have. Ah, little finger. That guy with all of, all of his scheming and like, such a waste, honestly. And the Red Wedding, you know what? Maybe I'll just do like a Game of Thrones review because <laughs> clearly all of this stuff is coming back. It's been over a year now, but it's all just Actually, like rewatched Breaking Bad recently, like last year, because I'm kind of trash like that. Once I watch something, it's kind of like fades. So I remembered nothing, especially not the ending. I was shook, shook at at the ending all over again for the second time <laughs> by myself i was like oh i did not see that coming but mm, i am the danger i am not in danger skylar i am the danger <laughs> <laughs> so choosing between the two okay if i'm just gonna go ending wise then definitely breaking bad wins cookies or chips Cookies, cookies, definitely cookies. Cookie monster. Uh, skydiving or bungee jumping? For some reason, I feel like skydiving is better. The thought of just attaching my life to this rope whilst I hurtle towards, it's always like over like a waterfall. So there's like jagged rocks at the bottom and that feels way worse. With skydiving, you free fall and it's not like, Wee! no, it's like, you know, gravity doing its thing, you know? So for some reason that just seems better to me. I know it's way worse because it's like, but anyway, that's just my perception of it. I'd rather go skydiving. I feel like that's safer. Introvert or extrovert? I have my moments. Yes, yes, I do have my moments. Well, I just want to be at home, read a book, drink lemon tea, just, yeah. And then other times I do this, but actually I don't know if this is, does this count as introvert or extrovert? Because I'm literally here talking to myself, <laughs> by myself, all day, every day, no shoes on. So I have moments um, of both, so... Yeah, I'm not sure which I lean more towards. Okay, I lean more towards the extrovert side, fine. The beach or swimming pool? That's kind of tough because I like both of them for their own reasons. Because they both imply that there's sunshine, it's a nice day, it's tropical, it's sunny, it's all of that. So I automatically like both. 
but I guess oh that's tough okay that's because I'm picturing like a very like white sand type of beach blue water azure how do you say that word azure azure yeah that blue water but then again there's also beaches where it's just like rocks and, and stones and it's like frosty cold water so uh, no i'm still gonna choose the beach but we disclaimer you and i know that i mean the white sandy azure beaches lipstick or mascara wow Definitely mascara. Like I said, I, I just don't know. Guys, I thought applying lipstick was simple. <laughs> it's not. It's not just a matter of, you know, no. You gotta like line the thing so that it doesn't just like seep out. And yeah, so we just stick to eyeliner and mascara and lip balm yeah i like i by default i now just prefer a glossy lip because the, the matte one it requires a little bit of technical know-how beard or clean shaven okay i'm assuming this question is not about me but my preference on guys so that would definitely be beard beard gang 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 <laughs> For the guys please 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 always consult your woman before shaving your beard your beard is not your own it's it's not your own there are people with vested interest solely in your beard shares they've got dividends in that beard so you don't just wake up one morning and just shave it off uh -uh. no no, no, online shopping or in-store shopping. You know what? My online store, my Taobao, that's the online store here in China. It is so tailor-made to me now, like it's streamlined, it knows me so well that it's such a huge temptation. As soon as I open my, my, my store, it's it's there's nothing that I don't like so that is actually a huge problem it's a huge huge problem <laughs> because now the recommendation engine has now fine-tuned its algorithm and it knows me like it just puts all of these things like how about this take a look at this how about that mm. so anyway yeah it's a trap so I basically just don't open it if I'm broke. <laughs> and speaking of which, actually, even when I go to the store, it's better if I go alone because then I can I can hold myself back. If I go with these people that I call my friends who make me just like Yolanda, Yolanda, she'll be like, girl, get it. You only live once. Why else are you working so hard? You deserve it. It's only one. Get that one too. Eh, eh. The same thing with Nyari. You guys, you guys, please get your hands out of my wallet. <laughs> please. <laughs> so, online or in store? In store. Ah, I don't know. I, I don't know. I'm, I'm just picking one because they both have their, their traps. iOS or Android? I said I wasn't going to start this war. You know what? I'll do a separate video on this one because I have very strong feelings about it. <laughs> but as a preview, Android. Mm, don't, don't fight me. Please, 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 please. Keep your three, three camera, one plate stove working thing away. <laughs> Football, basketball. Oh, I played basketball. I was a bona fide like baller, but yes, because of the height. Jeez. <sighs> no, honestly, people all the time used to be like, 
You're so tall. You should play basketball. You're so tall. Oh my gosh, do you play basketball? You definitely play basketball, right? So I gave in and I decided to play basketball. And I actually made it to the Zimbabwe national team for under 16s, which was a nerve wracking story as well. But that's another thing because we just lost all our games. We lost all of them and I was like, Mm, this is not going well and even after we lost like my team right i was still scouted they're like that one that one i was like feeling myself i'm feeling myself i was like yo with soccer right i am like a perennial fan i've become a super fan during the world cup like i remember me and my mom during the mm, which world cup was it that was in south africa that one we were like all up on the screen like Girl! oh my gosh pass the ball pass the ball and i will never forget this one line i think it was molly versus i don't know who but they were down four zero four zero and then they made a comeback they eventually won like five four if only i could remember who the teams were but it was lit and i remember the commentator's statement he said Oh my gosh, what a wonderful goal. We haven't seen a comeback like that since Lazarus. <laughs> I lost it. I was like, Lazarus, that was a major comeback. So I was so, so excited. And you can tell even now, like, <laughs> I still remember that. So with, with soccer, football, whatever, I'm like a seasonal fan. I like to watch highlights randomly sometimes, like I'll just go on YouTube and just like watch a random matches highlights. The same with basketball, so, but I think I'm more consistent with watching um, soccer and I do more of playing basketball, even though it's been a while. Turns out I talk a little bit too much, so I'm just gonna stop there. We'll continue in another video. But yes, guys, thank you so much for watching. Thank you, thank you so much. Please do share, like, subscribe, comment, tell me what you would like to see in the categories I mentioned before. And yes, basically, I hope to see you in my next video. And don't forget to glow grow and get it.